Bill Hollister is a uh, is a deputy, and he's kind of addicted to putting putting away bad guys, but then gets given this uh, the this mantle, newest, yeah, yeah, the mantle <laughs> out of nowhere, and um, so he changes his life, you know, changes his home life. He's basically responsible now for. 12,000 deputies in a big county of Los Angeles. 12,000 deputies. It's a huge Yeah, job. it's a big, yeah. The, I've learned so much about the sheriff department doing this show because um, it really makes the LAPD look small compared to the, the sheriff department. So it's pretty, uh, it's pretty interesting. Yeah, I kind of nerded out on it with that Den of Thieves movie. I, I didn't uh -huh. know anything about the sheriff's department, like being that the sheriff's department had that much power and that it could roll so deep. Yeah. It's huge. Yeah, and especially with weather and they really are kind of running the show when that stuff happens. What brought you to the project? Like, I, I would imagine after the True Detective with Mahershala, you guys, by the way, True Detective, if you haven't watched that season, it was the third season. <laughs> Mahershala and Steven, they play a multi-generational, um, each of them uh, a, a role that literally you go through their lifetime with them, and it was incredible. Oh, thank you so incredible much. Incredible work, beautiful. I love that, uh, I love that show, and I loved working with Mahershala and that capacity but uh, yeah deputy came up kind of right after that I did a film after true detective that hasn't come out yet and then deputy came and I was um, I was a little reserved at first jumping into a new show uh, you know but I really like Bill Hollister and I like David Ayer the director and I thought we could try to do something uh, different for network TV. And, yeah, you know. it's, that's what I loved about that True Detective. It was so layered, it took a completely different direction from the other seasons of it. Yeah, it gives you a lot more freedom, like, because I'd always come from making movies, and, and, you know, there's only so much you can do in an hour and a half or two hours, and, you know, when you get a good character, to be able to really stretch it out and play it, it that's, a, that's an awesome thing. Do you think you'd make a decent sheriff or law enforcement person? Yeah, I mean, I'm only I'm only nine episodes in now, so I don't think I'm ready to be sheriff. <laughs> but I uh, I worked with some great. I've been working with some great um, sergeants from major crimes, and and a lot of people have been really generous with their time from the sheriff department that are on set with us. And um, sometimes they have to go back to their day job and catch bad guys, and yeah, then we yeah, get yeah. a we get a new guy to come in and help. Um, but yeah, they've been really generous and just keeping it as authentic as we can. And I think I'd be good with the brain part of it, but I'm scared to death of going out there with guns and other people with guns. You know, that yeah. element of it would keep me from law enforcement. I think. Yeah, no, there's an incredible kind of uh, code that they have, and it basically, you know, Bill says it in the show a lot. He basically, our job is to put ourselves in, you know, on the front lines for, for people that we don't know and never will know, but that's, that's the job, you know, and there's, uh, there's kind of something amazing about that, whether you serve in the military, whether you serve in... Or a firefighter, firefighter. right, exactly. I have a lot of respect for any kind of law enforcement.